Kumusta mga magulang, mga mag-aral at mga kaguro? Ako ito muli si Simply Marbs, Maestro Olaso, nagbabalik. Tara nat, matuto! Ayan, nagbabalik tayo sa panibagong episode ng ating Taranat Matuto. Nagpapasalamat ako sa ating kaguro mula sa ikaanim na baitang, Sir Henry Doktora. Palagpakan naman natin si Sir Henry Doktora. Thank you so much, sir. At ngayon sa ating panibagong episode, tuturuan ko kayo ng mga iba't ibang mental math trick kung saan hindi nyo na kailangan gumamit ng papel sa pamamagitan ng pag-compute gamit ang ating mental ability, kaya nyo nang sagutin. At para sa ating mental math, trick number one, multiplying numbers by 11. Huwag na nating patagalin pa. Paano kung ang ating multiply ay sum of the digits less than 10? For example, find the product of 35 and 11. Let us just follow the steps on how to get 35 and 11 mentally. Step 1, split the number. Example, meron tayong multiply 35 times 11. Sundan natin ang step 1, split the number. Ating paghiwalin daw ang dalawang number. Ayan. Step number 2, add the digits and place the sum in the middle of the two digits. We are going to add the digits 3 plus 5. We have 8. And just put it in the middle. So therefore, 35 times 11 equals 385. You get it? Now, for case number 2, what if the sum of the digits is 3? 10 or more, yun ang problema. Paano kapag in natin ang digits, ay ang makukuha natin ay 10 or more. Ano ang gagawin natin? Example, find the product of 73 and 11. Let us follow the steps. Split the number. Again, 73 times 11. Let us split the number 7 and 3. And for step number 2, add the digits. Place the units digit of the sum in the middle of the two digits and carry the tens digit to the hundreds digits. Ibig sabihin, kapag inad natin yung 7 plus 3, we have 10. We'll just put the units digits 0 and carry the tens digit which is 1. So therefore, 7 plus 1 is equal to 8. Then, copy 0, 3. Therefore, 73 times 11 is equal to 803. Now, case number 3. What if we are going to multiply large numbers? Example, find the product of 17,426 and 11. Let us follow the step. Write 0 as the leftmost digit of the number. So, let us just put the given number, 17,426 times 11. Now, according to our step number 1, isulat daw natin ang 0 sa pinaka-leftmost digit of the number. Pag sinabing leftmost, ito sa pinakauna. So, 0, copy the digits, 1, 7, 4, 2, 6. Then follow step number two. To each digit, starting from the right, add the digit on its right. Ibig sabihin, magsisimula tayo sa right, i-add natin yung mga digit sa kanyang right. So let's start with six. Since six ay wala namang katabi sa kanyang right, we will just bring down six. Okay, the next digit is two. 
and let us add it to its right digit we have six so two plus six we have eight very good now let's proceed to the next digit four let us add to its right digit which is two so what is four plus two very good we have six and next digit seven let us add to its right digit four seven plus four we have eleven so what will you do bring down one then carry one then let's do the next digit one plus seven we have eight plus one we have nine and for the last digit zero zero plus one we have one therefore seventeen thousand four hundred twenty six times eleven is equal to one hundred ninety one thousand six hundred eighty six did you get it hopefully and let us must try the answer is of the following 17 times 11 so let us use the first uh, steps in finding this number we have 17 times 11 you just split the number 1 and 7 and what are you going to put in the middle? The sum of the digits 1 plus 7 equals 8 single digit. Therefore, we don't need to carry the next digit. So therefore, 17 times 11 is equal to 187. Let's proceed to number 2. 58 times 11. What do you think? Alright. So let's split the number 5 and 8. And let us put the digit number by adding 5 plus 8 equals 13. Since 13 is a two-digit number, we will put the units digit and put the tens digit in the hundreds digit. So therefore, we have carry 1 plus 5, we have 6. Copy 3, copy 8. Therefore, 58 times 11 is equal to 638 you got it congratulations now what about 325 million six hundred seventy one thousand eight hundred fourteen times 11 what is the answer let us follow the last step in finding this large number what is the first one okay we will put zero on the left most digit so we have zero copy the digits three two five six seven eight one four all right now since four the first digit has no digit on its right so just copy four now, second digit 1, add to the right digit 1 plus 4, 5. Next digit is 8, 8 plus 1, what's the answer? 9. Next digit is 1, add to its right digit, we have 1 plus 8, 9. 7, add to 1, equals 8. 6, Add to 7, we have 13. So therefore, bring down 3, carry 1. 5 plus 6, we have 11 plus 1, we have 12, carry 1. 2 plus 5 equals 7 plus 1 equals 8. 3 plus 2, we have 5. And for the last digit, 0, 0 plus 3 equals 3. Now, let, let us put a comma in order to read it properly. So our final answer is 3,582,318,000. Let's try the last one. 
634,526,307 times 11. Let's do the product. And let us put first 0 at the leftmost. Then copy the digit 6, 3, 4, 5, 2, 6, 3, 0, 7. Since uh, we have the last digit, copy 7. Then next digit 0 plus 7 equals 7. 3 plus 0, we have 3. 6 plus 3, we have 9. 2 plus 6, we have 8. 5 plus 2, we have 7. 4 plus 5, we have 9. 3 plus 4, we have 7. 6 plus 3, we have 9. And 0 plus 6, we have 6. And let us put a comma. 3, 3, 3. Therefore, our final answer is 6 billion. 979,789,377. Okay, and we will proceed to Market Market Time. Now, answer each of the following. You have five numbers, and let's do the hashtag. You have to put hashtag. Our hashtag is mental math trick one hashtag mental math trick one then get a piece of paper you have to show me your answer using your mental math one two three four and five and post it to the comment section of our Brizal Brigada Escuela now na Again, hashtag mental math trick one. All right, maraming salamat sa inyong panonood. Happy learning! Sorry, it's DJ.